Hi everyone, this is Dawn with DEK Designs and I'm going to do a plan with me today. Um, it's a little bit, I'm filming it a little bit late. I was a little under the weather, had a cold thing. I still have a little bit of a cough. So hopefully I don't cough. So we are planning this current week. <clears throat> the week of the 20th in my Aurora Still Planner. And then I'm going to also grab out my essentials, which is where I do my overview. If I can get it out of here, okay. Um, so I have kind of like my overview for the week that I'll reference back to that. And my monthly is also in here that I will reference back to why I am planning. So this week I decided to use um, the Plant Mom kit and I'll just run through it really quick. These are um, eight full boxes, the washi and date covers, the checklist, some more washi, scallop headers, functional boxes, deco, another two set of deco boxes, your sidebar, your dates, your weekend, your icons, and your headers. So let's get going on this. Let's lay down some of the washi first. Um, hope everyone is doing well. I know I am super excited for spring to get here. We have another winter storm warning that goes in effect at noon today. So Katie's in there trying to get orders some orders ready to go to the post office before the ice starts. So we're gonna get some snow, but it sounds like Minneapolis is gonna get the brunt of it. Um, but we're gonna get a lot of ice with the storm. So yeah, that's never any good. Cause there's nothing that really can get around an ice. And hopefully we just don't lose our power. It seems like whenever we have an ice storm, we tend to lose our power. It brings down power lines and such. So we got, um, oh, I'm gonna, ooh. I'm gonna move this. No, I don't wanna move it. Cause this, I wanna do a little something different here on the bottom, so let's move it over three boxes. I don't wanna do the exact same thing this week, um, just because the reason for my videos is trying to inspire you, trying to give you some new ideas um, of what you could do. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's do a little wood accent above this. I'm curious, is anybody watching, do you have this planner and um, how do you use it? If you could leave a comment below, that would be great. I haven't ran into many videos using this planner. One of the reasons I chose to use this also for this year, but I've seriously been think thinking about supplementing my system and um, adding the Hobonichi back in in June or I guess it would be July <clears throat> so 
So we got our sub boxes, our, our subscriptions out yesterday. And it's like my favorite so far this year. It's really pretty. I'm excited for everyone to get them and see what you guys do with the stickers. Okay, let's put our date covers over. So I'm gonna just center Monday over here. And Tuesday, I'm just kind of eyeballing it. I have been pli um, planning as I go this week in my weeks planner from Aurora still in any plans, but I felt really naked not having my main planner done. So I'm glad I was well enough today to do this video so I can get all my plans down. Okay, so Monday was the 20th. Um, I also have a Oh my goodness, what is the name of it? I'm drawing a blank. Well, I have another A5 book bound. I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head. <clears throat> and I've been like, just trying to do calligraphy and just fun mixed media. It just, is enjoyable to me. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> so I am gonna let's let's use these little scallop headers underneath each day. I think the last two weeks I've been using the scallop half circles, so we'll go with the headers for this week. so far. Okay, I'm going to do, <clears throat> let me see here, what do I do with that page over here? I'm going to do one of these, Ex the extra date cover, day cover, and then put a this week header in the box. So this week, I will, I'm going to use this girl up here. She's so cute. And then a glitter. tracker <clears throat> uh, let's use 
the light green. And the brown. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna put another piece of glitter in. And then I'm gonna put my um, tracker, another tracker in here. This is for sleep. And I don't want it to be blank behind Boo, so I'm gonna add, let's see, what could I add? I think, um, let's just do a checklist. So, Boo has some background behind her. Okay, <clears throat> and then let's do, see this is gonna be off, even the Boo's off a little bit. I, got it. I have it crooked, but I have it on top of a sticker, so I don't think it's gonna come up good, but let's try. Yeah, it's gonna rip the sticker. So I'll put something there, otherwise it'll bug me because it's off. Okay, let's do another glitter. And then this other piece of washi, and it's still not gonna be even. Um, this isn't quite turning out like I had hoped, <laughs> but we're just going to roll with it. Okay. So in the corner here where everything's kind of janky and off, I want to put something that's going to kind of cover that. <coughs> I don't know if I wanna, yeah, I'm just gonna do another girl. And there, can't even tell. And I'll put some kind of sticker there or something. Okay, <clears throat> so Monday I want to do a box right away to signify that there was no mail. And I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna do, I always track my meals too, so I'm just gonna track that over here. And... Again, that's to cover up my unevenness. Let's put a little candle here. Okay, um, let's see what would look good. I think I want to do this box kind of right here. And Let's see, let's put a flag in right there and a flag right here and then another box. Let's use this rounded one and stick it right there. Okay. Looking good, looking good. I didn't, um, Kinda, I don't plan in in this planner in exact square boxes. And I really kind of like the way it works. Gives me plenty of writing room and yeah. So Tuesday, let's put the shopping cart in. Okay. 
and we will line that one up. And it's so crooked. Oh, sorry, that's the foiling machine turning off. Okay, try this again. Way better. That was the box shipping day. Let's see. really pretty. I'm just going to line it up on the edge over here. And I'm going to put a checklist in. Even with the day cover, I'm also going to add a flag check checklist, or it's not really a flag, it's square, but I'm going to add an extra one in right here. And a box. And then I'm going to layer a couple hexagons. Okay, let's flip the page. I want to use the scene in the middle, so let's do that first. Plant, grow, bloom. That's so pretty. Let's put that over here. And we'll put this one up here. Just, I'm just um, trying to distribute the page <clears throat> somewhat evenly. I'm gonna put my extra, actually I have Where'd she go? Here she is. Oops. Oh my goodness. I'm a hot mess today. <laughs> All right. Let's stick her down here. And then my last box. I'm going to put over here. I think that looks really symmetrical to me. Um, and I think I'm thinking, trying to think of something creative to do with the weekend banner. I think I just might put it in the middle of this right here. I mean, it will take about some writing space, but I'm okay with that. That looks like the middle to me. Okay. 
I'm gonna put down some more of these little, I don't know what to call them, square little deco boxes, and then I write to the side of them. If you can think of a good name for these little boxes, let me know. See how that looks with some deco on it. Something different. Okay, uh, let's put down an appointment box there, and let's put the other one over here. I kind of want to offset it. Okay. I need another checklist on this week. Let's do one over here. And I think I'm gonna do one over here under Saturday. Oh, you know, I forgot my, I wonder if this is gonna come up. I wanted to put my flags down before the weekend. Oh yeah, it came right up, okay. So I just kind of offset them a little bit to give it a little more. zest or something. I think that looks gorgeous. Okay. And let's do a checklist down here. Throw a little over here. No. Okay. I always use all my hexagons because they're just fun to mark off something. that happened in your day. Oh, that's where the paper came up a little bit. I'm just gonna cover it <laughs> with the hexagon, there you go. Okay, I think we have most of the boxes that I need, I wanna, Put down um yeah let's do that let's do a scallop above this one and above this one so these two pages are pretty much gone Couple more boxes. Okay. I'm going to throw some glitter headers above some of the deco boxes. look weird to put one over there. Yeah, I'm not gonna because, oh, I wanna put one over here because these ones aren't and I don't wanna mess with moving all of them. But I will move this one. Oh, there's already a glitter header. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm 
just gonna put this down here. It didn't look right up there. There we go. I think that looks better. Okay, um, let's put down some deco. This is really pretty. I'm gonna layer it with a swishy. Use this big plant mon coffee cup by Monday. Hmm. I want something down here. Maybe something over here. This little heart cactus, that is so cute. <laughs> I'd love to, I'd love to have one of those. That'd be really cute. Okay, so I want to do something right here. We still have a couple girls. Put her there, that looks great. And these long, I'm sorry if I'm going off a of camera, I'm just. And put those plants there and then I have to do up here. This is very, very cute, this antique watering pot. So I'm gonna kind of layer it like that. That's cute. Do you guys have plants? I love them. I'm not the best plant mom. And I was actually thinking about maybe getting a, there's an app that you can download. I'm not sure how much it costs every month, but it, um, you can take a picture of what your plant looks like and it'll tell you if it needs like coffee or sugar. I've seen some weird stuff in their advertisements. So I thought that may, might be kind of cool to do that. I don't like that. <clears throat> so if it's not terribly expensive, I'm probably going to do that. I think that is everything. So I went to Mark Water My Plants and there's a little flower right here. So I'm gonna use that. Put it right here. So I don't forget. I'll have to show you guys my plants one of these days. I'm pretty proud of them. Um, Saturday. I'm gonna put a little ice cream thing here. So Katie and I went to, um, when we took the boxes yesterday, we stopped at Culver's 
and I had a turtle sundae and it was divine. It was so good. I want to go get another one. But there's also a popcorn place that we've seen. So I'm going to mark that too. I want to pick up some popcorn from there. Okay, and Sunday is new releases. And um, that's going to be part of this list. And I want to put something there. I want to put a star. Okay, let's just write it in. Um, I ordered these pins off of Amazon. And where's the one that was in my planner? Oh, I'm not sure. And I really like them. I saw their uh, ad on Instagram, Right Tech, their 0.5. But the feeling of it is just like super smooth, like that velvety cardstock that you feel. I mean, it's just very comfortable to hold. And I'm just gonna write new releases in here. Let's see, should we go backwards? So I won't be able to fill that until I get closer or actually really any of this so I think this base of Thursday through Sunday is done and yesterday I want to mark that we shipped the boxes I should put, I wonder if I should highlight that somehow you know there's a little Happy Mail truck here, so I'm going to use that. And then we went to Culver's, and I want to mark that. I think we have an ice cream. No, 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 no. I'm gonna use a little balloon. <clears throat> yeah, so I don't, I think their ice cream isn't really ice cream. It's called something else. It's called, um, oh. I don't remember, but it was really good. So I definitely want to get more of that. Oh, and then I um, drew Emma's So I want to bring some new Emma's to the shop Sunday and I'm working on like a, a puppy and a kitty to mark like if you have to take your puppy to the vet or on a walk or playtime or um, they're looking really cute. So I'm excited to show you guys. Monday, there was no mail. I want to mark that. Um, this happy meal. Icon. And what did we have for dinner? It's downstairs in my week's planner, but I remember last night we had pizza. We were all too tired to cook, and so we ordered Pizza Hut, and then Monday we had a hot dish. Um, I call it goulash, my husband calls it hot dish. Um, so he made it, I'm marking it as hot dish. It was really good. 
Okay. This needs something, doesn't it? Right here, it looks kind of wanky. Maybe just a glitter header. But I don't want it to run. Let me just cut a little piece off. Just eyeballing it, so hopefully it works. No, I cut too much. <laughs> okay, where did I put it? Oh, it's on my scissors. So I'm just gonna stick this over the top and then it'll be even. If I can get it off my scissors. Here we go. There we go. I almost wanna put something there. Let's see, <clears throat> I'm gonna cut this. Yeah, I'm gonna cut this and stick it there. Like it's coming out of the little tracker here. Oh, I wanted to do it over a little bit <clears throat> to cover where the brown and the you guys are seeing all my struggles today with the, the brown and the green meat. I wanted to kind of cover that up. Oh, it came up perfect. That's one thing I love about these new stickers is it's so forgiving to take them up off of the Tomo River paper compared to our previous stickers we were using. So, yeah, I think that's all I can fill in except let's mark that we are in a storm morning today. And it's gonna be freezing rain and snow, so I'm gonna do this. storm thing here. That's cute. You know, these went, I should probably add these to the shop because <clears throat> I use them all the time. But um, these were part of our Easter egg bundle last year. And I'm going to put literally freezing because the temperatures are going to be falling all day today. I know it's silver and the kit's rose gold, but I think it looks fine. I do not, I don't, I don't mind mixing foils on layouts. To me, it looks, it looks just fine. Okay, oh, and I want to throw some Emma's in, maybe a couple boos in. So this is just a releasable sticker book. And tonight I am going to be working on designs. Let's just use this gray. We try to do all the Emma's in neutral colors to go with any of your spreads. Same with Boo. We've been switching Boo to our neutral palette to match Emma. And... Let's see here. Oh, yeah. Th tomorrow, Thursday, is payday. I want to mark that. Just put it right in here. And this is gold hollow, but I think it still looks okay with the rose gold. Oh, yep, I'm afraid I want to wash my hair. And it'll get 
totally filled in by the end of the week. And I'll probably also use my Tombow 312. I think it goes really good with the kit colors. So that is this week. It'll get all filled in and look gorgeous by the time I'm done. This I'll do my sleep and this will be the days and this will be the hours. I mean, I could just put them in here with you. Um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And let's do two, three, four, five, six. I usually sleep because of my stupid fibro, I usually sleep like three, three to five hours on average a night. <clears throat> so that's why that looks weird with the, how many hours or when I started with two instead of five or something. So that is this week. Um, next week is gonna be um, a collaboration with some of our PR girls and we're gonna all use the same kit and I will link their their um, YouTubes in my description so you can see how we all um, beautifully decorate our planners in different styles. So that is all for today. Thank you so kindly for watching and I hope this gave you a few inspirational ideas to use for your plans. Stay safe, sane, and well-planned. Bye.